you. Okay, uh, thank you so much. We'll keep it with the weather here. The wet weather, of course, making a mess for drivers, creating several accidents. This all as the LA River just keeps on rising. KCAL News reporter Candace Crone shows you what it looks like today. The rain has let up at least for now, but the streets are still soggy. Uh, take a look. Drivers are managing okay, though, going normal speeds, but that's not the case across other parts of the city. Through the intersection of Laurel Canyon Boulevard and Woodbridge Street this afternoon, steady rain caused some substantial flooding. Cars even turning around, not chancing, trying to drive through all that standing water. You can get an idea of just how high it got to the back of a damaged car there. Earlier in the day, it looked to be about six inches deep. It didn't take long to get the LA River flowing. Water gushed down the river. Fortunately, though, people kept clear and no reports of any incidents. We spoke to people running errands. They said the rain isn't stopping them from their day to day routine. Routine, but they've had to use extra caution navigating the slick roads. I think something that's been a little more of a, a barrier is the fact that there's not a lot of drainage on the street, so that tends to flood a lot quicker than maybe like East Coast infrastructure. So that's the only thing that I would say makes it a little difficult, like getting to places, especially when it's like a heavy downpour. So you're like driving through a mini river just to get to the other side. And we've been seeing like photos of like people's mini coops and stuff like that, like floating from the flooding. So that's been a little scary. And we checked out a nearby hillside community that experienced mud flows in January storm. Fortunately, things look good there and no issues to report. Reporting in Studio City, Candace Crone, KCAL News. Well, our Michelle Geely spent the day